Hello, this is Pastor Mike from Twin Peaks Community Church, and today's video update takes place here among the California poppies growing at the church. Thanks, Carl and Helen, for planting these. They are absolutely beautiful. Did you know that California poppies open and close with the sunlight? When it's dark, they close up, and then when the sun comes out, they open up. That seems like maybe a picture of what's happening with our churches. As you know, the coronavirus has caused our churches to be closed these past few months. It's like a time of darkness for the church. But praise God, they're beginning to open now. The sun is shining. Let's pray that they open fully and that our churches remain open. Now, our state has issued some guidelines for worship services. Maybe you saw this in the paper this week. In a nutshell, it says that we can only have 25% of our capacity in church at one time. And for our church, that means approximately 60 people. So we have decided as an elder team to offer the same three worship options as last Sunday. Let me remind you of those. Option number one, I hope you can see that. Stay home and watch the service on Facebook Live. Now, of course, this is the least risky option. If you have health issues or a weakened immune system, Please stay home and stay safe. There's no guilt in not coming. We totally understand that. Option number two, stay in your car and enjoy the drive-in worship service. You can listen uh, to the message, to the music, through your outside speakers or through your car radio. You can also, if you want, bring a lawn chair and sit outside in the shade. This is also a low-risk option since you're separated from others. The third option is maybe the most risky. Come inside and worship inside the church. Again, we must limit this to only 60 people and they should exercise the social distancing protocol. In other words, we need to sit six feet away from others who are not in our family. And we really should be wearing face masks, which we will provide, but we will not enforce. Now for those choosing this option, you will be inside the sanctuary with the worship team while I'll be speaking from outside in the back of my pickup. Uh, we'll try to display the message on Facebook Live on the inside screens. Now, obviously this is the most risky option, so choose wisely. Please only come in if you're healthy and if you're somewhat younger. Well, that might eliminate 90% of our congregation. In all seriousness though, we want you to exercise caution. We don't want to expose anyone to this virus, so be careful as you interact with others to be safe. If you have any questions, please feel free to call me. The church number is 909-337-3011, and my cell phone number is 909-273-0385. Let's pray, pray before we have our services tomorrow. Lord, we ask you to give us wisdom and discretion as we move forward. We want to be open, but we also want to be safe. So give us the patience uh, needed to see this opening happen. And we pray that that would happen soon. We claim your promise. I will build my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. Lord, let your church move forward, we pray in Jesus' name, amen. Well, thank you again for joining me and I look forward to seeing you Sunday morning if you're able to be here. May God richly bless you.